Okie dokie guys, here it is. I have it. A water candy corn LMG. Very modded. Oh yes, definitely. So, I'm trying to figure out what makes this gun very, very special. And I can tell you is that its two elementals are completely different. They literally changed the weapon of this gun and how it's supposed to work. Because on this last perk, it says each shot fire grants plus one eight point percent damage for one second stacks up to 15 times. Now, using this weapon, you can literally pack a freaking punch to the enemies just shooting and shooting every single time. But since it's water, we gotta fight Firehouse to get the full maximum potential of this modded weapon. Now, it's very funny because I still haven't really shot this weapon. It's just been sitting in my storage for like two days or one day. So, I'm not sure if it really drops candy corn. And that's why we're gonna give it a try. And... Every time I log on to YouTube, I've just been seeing so many freaking people just having this weapon and trading it and duping it and doing giveaways and stuff like that. And it's pretty freaking crazy. And my question is, like, how the hell did they even manage to get this weapon? Where to come from? Who is the mastermind? I want to know. I want to know who made this watered candy corn LMG. Got to try to get to the bottom of this, bro. Got to Batman this shit be detectives but oh well let's test this shit out so before I test it out guys here's the original schematic for the candy corn LMG now as you can see if I try to prick it up or change the uh, elemental it won't let me change it it's only physical and of course the original perk is that every time when I kill an enemy I get their little sweet gummy worms and I eat it all up I regain some health and that's about it so here's the water candy corn in action. Come at me, husk. Okay, as you can see right there, it's doing pretty good water damage. Wow, that's very impressive, but as you can tell, it's not dropping any single candy corn. No candy corn at all, which is very disappointing because it is called the candy corn LMG. You know, it's supposed to give me like food and comida to survive just in case you know situations like this don't go well <laughs> you see what I mean so shooting that gun is definitely powerful just right there for that beginning second so right here we're gonna test out my physical one and see if there's any really you know big difference at all but also I'm using a little bit of different perks as well and as you can see look at that candy corn is being dropped and I'm getting shot by all these dumbass miss monsters. But look at that. And this is just a physical. This is only a physical. And this gun is kicking a lot of ass. So in the meantime, I'm gonna try to find like a group of fire enemies and just blast them all up with the water LMG. Die. Is it just me or the hustle like walking, sleeping hot Cheetos? I don't know, I'm just craving on Cheetos right now, but let's go for it. Oh, die. Just can you manage can you can you just imagine being a husk and you're just trying to fall asleep and then suddenly some girl just comes up to you with an LMG and just blasts you around the face and boom, you're gone for existence. Oh man, I feel so sorry for these husk. Poor them, especially for this bastard. Sorry man, gotta put you out of your misery. Welcome to the candy corn live biatch. Oh yeah, you're dead. You're dead. Wink. Although I gotta admit, having a water candy corn LMG that, sh that shoots water is pretty amazing. Like, it's a good combo. Like, having a water candy corn and a physical just so you can kill at least the mist monsters. And you can gain so much damage from this weapon. And then, like, pick up the candy. I mean, wow. This is pretty much a new gameplay experience of what I'm experiencing. So I shoot the water. Boom, 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 boom. Hopefully I just don't miss my shots. Just like that. But of course, all those little bastards. And then, you know, I just bring my other LMG out and I just shoot the ones that I don't have any elemental on them. And then, bam, they're dead. So, I gotta say, shooting this water candy corn LMG is pretty much fun, but sadly, I don't think there's a lot of people that are gonna actually use the weapon because it's just gonna stay in their freaking storage for eternity or probably for trading and getting other weapons, which is pretty dumb because, wow, using this gun right here, I'm having a good time. Very good experience. So I just discovered something. So if you have a regular candy corn LMG, it will do this. Now, if you have a modded LMG, 
it would do this. You heard that, right? That little mm. <laughs> weak. Just for the shits and the giggles, I'm gonna use a 130 water on a hundred nature husk. Oh no, that's a very newbie thing to do, but hey, I don't care. Let's get rock and rolling. Ooh, wait, come on, boy. Come on, come on, hit me. Ooh, yeah, you did hit me good, didn't you, huh? Ooh, man, that health is draining down super duper quick. Holy shit. Damn. And boom, got your balls. And now you guys are dead. Stop hitting me, yo. Wow. So technically, 100 bullets from this 130 water weapon was definitely fun. That was super duper quick. We killed that smasher within no time using a 130 LMG water freaking gun. Amazing. Boy's about to get me shrecked up in here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, get blown up. Wow. Even the water's doing great damage against physical husk. That's amazing. That's freaking amazing, yo. We got a dab stand for that. Uh. Look what we have right here. An archaeological jest in our mitt when I'm trying to do a video of a candy corn LMG. No way in hell I'm going to have her in my lobby. Hell no. Every time when I try to make a video, there's always some outlander just doing this little stupid pickaxe, just doing this, trying to get my attention. What do you want? Oh yeah, and you know what's funny? I mean, since <laughs> this is way out of topic, is that that person is an outlander, like literally, and you're begging me for shit? Come on, homie. Oh my god, we just discovered a 116 fire smasher. Yes, but of course, right beside him is a damn husky. Right huskies, fatties, whatever you want to call them. Sorry, buddy, gotta wake your little belly up. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> wow wow i am complete shock bro <laughs> that smasher died he died and just disappeared bro oh my god that was amazing damn i love you candy corn water whatever you're called candy corn lmg Alright guys, so this is going to be the end of the video, and I gotta say, using this 130 LMG in 140 zones against Firehouse is definitely a pack a punch. I would love to have at least 5 of these weapons in my storage right now so I can wreck those husks left and right, make them dance, make them dead. And I gotta give a shout out to my boy Jaden Sabas who happened to give me this weapon for free out of nowhere. He just dropped it, picked it up, it was a candy core LMG, and he said you can have it man, I was like cool bro. Awesome, and this weapon has served me right. I absolutely love it. I wish I can have like more, like I said, so I can destroy those husks until they're dead. But if you guys get your hands on one of these candy corn LMGs 130s, definitely use it in special occasions. Definitely, definitely use it. Because my god, this weapon is a beast. Even though it doesn't drop candy corn, but holy hell, it's six perk is so much damage. So much damage. And for that, I, I gotta eat a little piece of pizza, you know? Because, one, I'm hungry while making this video. And two, she's probably hungry, and she's happy about it. With that being said, guys, I will see you on the next Dragon Ball Z. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up this video and subscribe.